Hello, my name is Rick and my call is Papa Yank 2 Echo Lima. I live in Sao Paulo, Brazil and today I'm gonna show you how to tune the linear amplifier, the 3001 linear amplifier made by Collins. Um, I choose the frequency on 20 meters, uh, it's not being used for nobody. So I'm gonna show you how to tune it. So the radio is already tuned, so I have I have done it before. Um, so let's see how much power we have using the, the Collins transceiver. It's like 30 watts. We can start uh, running 30, 40 watts uh, using this 40 watts. Okay. So that's enough for tuning the 30 L1 to start the tuning. So let's turn it on, the linear amplifier. Okay, the plate voltage here. The voltage is uh, 220 and the plate voltage will be around 1.8 kilovolts, okay? Okay, so first of all, on the band selector, on the, bu the band button, you must find the band, the band, what, what you want to, to tune. So I pick 14, 20 meters, and uh, on the tuning button, I will put also on 14 meters. On the load, I must be on zero number one actually on the number one the first one here number one we can start using that so if you use a uh, um, non collins uh, transceiver you must put on on the meter on DC amps and if you use a tune a collins transceiver you must pick you must choose the tune button okay so we're gonna leave like this on the tune because I'm gonna use the tune button here as well. Okay, with 30 watts, we can see how much power we're gonna get with uh, the 30 L1. Okay, 30 watts. Now on the scale will be two, two kilowatts, and I will restart um, the tuning button like this, trying to get the the highest power output okay very very slow okay now after this we're gonna go to learning loading tune button the loading button we're gonna increase a little bit there we go okay all right that's enough release the the, the emission button and then we're gonna increase the power output a little bit, a little bit. And then we're gonna do that at same again, the tune, the lock button, the emission on the lock position. Okay, hold on. On the lock position. We can have on the tuning 600 watts so I release the button the drive is being 80 watts that's too much that's too much so we don't need to use that much 70 70 or 80 is that is okay. okay we have um, 80 watts driving and back again here on the tune button we check the highest power output but we cannot forget the DC amp DC amp must be always zero or closest to zero so when I turn it on when I tune the amplifier you see the one and point six 
there's gonna be a problem it's too much drive for the 811 so what we have to do is to reduce the power output and then we can have a better results there okay all right Once again. The power output is still 500 watts with a 30 watts driving and the level is a DC amp will be 0.6. Okay. This is how to tune the, the 30 or one linear amplifier. It's simple, not so complicated, and uh, this is the fast way when we use the Collins 30, uh, the Collins KWM2A, and the 30L1 linear amplifier. Good luck, 73 from PY2E out.